Today, we're going to be walking you through our N54 full bolt-on kit tailored to your needs for your build. And this is how we got our N54 powered 335XI up to 400 wheel horsepower. It's going to start off with the front mount intercoolers. You can either select the five inch or from there, you can upgrade to the seven inch or the seven and a half inch 1K intercooler. After that, you can match the color with whatever your build would need. We have sport silver, trophy gold, graphite, or stealth black. And then after that, you can also select our stencil to rep our motorsports on your intercooler. The next selectable option in our drop down menu is going to be the hose upgrade kit. We do have two selections for that, one for the five and seven inch upgrade, and then one for the 1K. These are gonna increase the diameter of the intercooler piping from two inches to three inches throughout, and it will upgrade our 1K intercooler lower charge pipe upgrade kit by removing three of the connections to allow for better airflow. Another option in our upgrade kit is required for stage two tuning, and that's gonna be our down pipes. We do have two selections. One is gonna be for the rear wheel drive N54 and one for the X drive or all wheel drive option. These are gonna be required for stage two to allow more flow out of the turbo when we're requesting higher boost targets out of the stock turbo. This next option here is gonna be the most crucial for the N54, which is the charge pipe. Even if you're on a stock tune, the charge pipe is one of the most important things for the N54. The stock charge pipe is gonna be made out of plastic and during heat cycles, it gets brittle and is very easy to blow off again, even under stock boost. So here we have three options. We have the OEM diverter valves, the HCAS flange charge pipe, and then the tile flange, which we do have the option of the blow off valve for this one. So for normal tunes, you can stick with the OEM diverter valve charge pipe, but if you're gonna really start pushing max effort out of your turbos or even upgrade the turbos, we highly suggest to move over to a aftermarket blow off valve. And then we have two options with that, the HKS and the tile. These are gonna have a little bit different notes of the actual blow off sound. Also the flanges are going to be different. So you do wanna double check if you already have the blow off valve, which one you have so you can make sure that they do fit on there without any issues. And then as mentioned, we do offer the Tile Q blow-off valve. This is gonna be a 50 millimeter blow-off valve by Tile. It also comes with a 1 8 inch rubber hose for the vacuum line, or we do have the option to upgrade that line to one and a quarter. It also has a tap for the map sensor and then it's got this hard plastic line that will tie into the top of the blow-off valve. This helps with surging. When it comes to the intakes, we have two very different options with the simple and the more involved. This is gonna be our dual cone intake. It's gonna be pretty straightforward on the top of the engine bay. It'll give you the air intake induction noises that you like out of a turbocharged system. But then if you wanna get a little bit more power out of it, but put a little bit more work in, you can move over to our relocated inlets this is gonna be a very involved install. You're gonna be removing a lot of things, um, kind of loosening the engine on its mounts, but the power gains are definitely worth it and it sounds pretty good. Another little option in there that we have is gonna be our inlet adapter kit. This is gonna be for our relocated inlets if you still have stock turbos. There are gonna be little couplers here that you see that go over the turbos and then the inlets can go on there. Um, they're great to have if you're looking to upgrade your turbos. What goes in must come out, and that brings us to our last option, which is the outlets here. These are gonna change from a one inch on the OEM outlets to a two inch. It's also gonna be made out of aluminum with this coupler in the middle. This is gonna drastically improve airflow out of the turbo. We hope that was a great breakdown of our full bolt-on kit for your N54. If you have any other questions or just wanna check out more stuff, reach out to armmotorsports.com for your upgrades today.